Hello, my name is Mariah, and today I am going to discuss why there should not be a state-free health care plan. As adults, you know the importance of such a situation, or if you don't, hopefully by the end of this speech, as we discuss certain points such as the money that would be put into it, the um, if this the efficiency that could be created outside of it, and the other ways that it should be instead channeled, you will be able to see why it is important, and therefore stand with me as we make a one voice, one united voice for such a situation. My first point is that free health care sucks up tax money that should be used in other areas that have more need. Rather than providing free health care for every person that has a low income, the real areas of need should be targeted. The homeless should be taken care of, dangerous roads should be prepared, and the well-being of the environment that pe people live in should be increased. That is what tax dollars should be used for, not health care that lets others laze around. People should be able to support themselves. This leads to my next point, that people can support themselves. There's a certain pride that comes from providing health care, food, and housing for one's family. To know that it's through your hard work that you're living a good life. This is what America needs more of, more hard work and less sitting around. If free health care is implemented, it would mean that more people would find excuses for just getting by, and the real problem of poorness would never be fixed. But how do people support themselves? My third point is that tax dollars should go toward the needless that go that would go towards the needless free health care should instead be channeled towards creating jobs that would be that will be needed so that the population can support themselves. Obviously, we did discuss this earlier on, how the tax money would be used up needlessly in free health care. Now, I am, I am proposing that that tax money instead go to provide the jobs that it would take to support the people so that they do not need the free health care. While people are generating their own money and their own um, health care, the state will prosper in every way. First the government without the load of useless health care, then the people, then the people who can support themselves. Those who support themselves are more likely to be responsible in areas of government as well. Voting rates would go up, people would be interested in what's happening in today's world, and the whole lackadaisical attitude would be straightened out. Finally, as you can see, if free health care is provided, it would be destructive to our society. The choice of not providing it would only benefit the state in every way. It's important that we do not allow free health care to become implemented and instead stand up for the rights of the people so that we can be self-sufficient and find a better society emerging because of it. Thank you for your time.